no indication whatsoever this is anything that you think of in terms of international terrorism or whatever. But the reality is this type of random crime does terrorize both individuals and communities. And, and the impact in that sense is, is similar. The information of the community that they need to have, even though the killer may be watching. We have urged uh, everyone to continue uh, with all of the different events, whether they be large scale, such as uh, uh, the football games, or, or whether they be uh, smaller community activities. That we're trying to provide every security uh, possible on this. We have to use some common sense, uh, but we cannot permit uh, one uh, individual uh, to disrupt uh, our entire uh, personal lives, uh, and our, our community life, and, and our economy. Yeah, it crossed my mind. My mom called, made sure, hey, be careful up there, baby, you know, that type of stuff. But, uh, you know, you just got to keep on living your life. We can tell things have changed a little. The way they're parking people today is, uh, you know, the, the police on horses. We've not seen that before, but it uh, wasn't a concern, though. We were... Uh, are you are you working? I mean, getting gas? I watch I watch everything when I get gas now. It's it's horrible. So it's changing the way that you. Live. Absolutely, and it sucks. Coming here, I thought about today. I'm not even coming here today, but I did.